Another day, another arm workout closer to our goal. You know, this week has been pretty tough to get myself out of bed. Usually I'm up and running, but physically I'm just feeling tired. And that's okay. I could definitely do a little bit better with my sleep, but this week I've really had to lean on and remind myself why. Why am I doing this? Why do I put myself through all the training, dieting, sacrifice? And I'll tell you why. But I'm curious to know, why do you work out? Are you training for something in specific? Do you just work out to enjoy more fun foods? What drives you? For me, I just always go back to how I felt my last show. And for those of you that are curious, that video is up on my channel in case you guys want to check it out because that's a whole another topic for another day. But I just never want to feel like how I felt that day again. It just really stuck with me. And there's not a workout session I don't think about it. It's my driver. It's the reason why I push so hard. You think I uh, enjoy bulking for months and saying no to trips and doing long cardio sessions? No, but not everything you love and enjoy comes easy, right? So I guess what I'm trying to say here is it's okay to feel tired or unmotivated at times. What's not okay is you giving up. So anytime you're overthinking and feeling discouraged, stop and remember why you started this whole thing in the first place because if it's worth it to you then you'll keep going and i promise you you'll find a way for me it's the feeling of knowing knowing i knew i could do it and everything i'm doing now is gonna pay off anyways i feel like i wanted to share that with you welcome to day 24. we'll be meeting Vinny later on this evening for a late night leg workout and knowing him He's gonna push me to help. So today should be a good testament to see how bad I really want it. What is up YouTube? It's Vinny here. You know, not G right now. Right now he's warming up doing his hamstrings. Now since we're under contract, signed by both of us, he has no choice but to do this leg day with me. So we're about to run him through his full leg day. We did adductors and hip abductors, just the ins and outs, just to warm up those hip flexors and just get everything warmed up. Right now we're doing a little uh, cable RDL, um, which you'll see here in a moment, just to warm up everything. And then we're gonna go into our compound movement. So stay tuned guys, he ain't ready. Let's get it. Four. Four or five sets on the 
Hey guys, I know I said I wasn't gonna be a little bitch today and I wasn't gonna tap out and I was gonna give my absolute all. Let's go push! <laughs> yup. Oh, Come shit. on, last one. So I wasn't gonna let Vinny dominate me, but I think he's already dominating me with letting me know that we're doing five sets on this thing and our warm up is a plate already, 45. There's no bitch in here, boys. G, come on. Remember, we're just gonna we're just gonna see where we're at and then go from there. So, if, what's up, buddy? How are you? We're like five. Feeling good? I just feel a lot coming, so just want to get nice and warmed up. He's never hit two plates before since last leg day. He hit two plates on this pendulum, and he has a hard time, you know. Legs, legs are very, like, it's, it's not a strong point, but it's also something since he's had, you know, something wrong with his knees in the past, that it's very hard to get over that fear, especially have the confidence to push that weight. But like I said, having a consistent and, you know, reliable workout partner that pushes you without, you know, obviously hurting yourself to a degree, it just sees you past that point where you feel like you can do this. And, and just reassure your workout partner. Because when you reassure your workout partner, he's hit this for 10 last time for two plates. I'm gonna do two plates in a 25, but we're gonna push him past two plates today. Because you know, like I said, I'm pushing him to death here today, guys. So let's see how he feels and let's see what he responds to after that. See you guys in a bit. Let's go big dog. Boy. Yep. yep. All right, here we go. Three more. Yep, I got you. Let's do it. Yep. Yep. Oh boy. Up. Yeah. One more. One more. One more. Yeah. Sick man. Yep. Drive. Yep. Down. Right away. Keep attention. Yup, push, down, right away. Don't think about it. Yup, right back down, yup, come on. I'll push you down, come on. Yup, back down. Yup. Two more, come on. Let's go, push. Yup, come on, last one. Come on, last one and two with me. Let's go. Last one with two with me, come on. Ready? Yup, come on. That's all you see. I'm with you. Let's go. Come on. Yup. Push. Yup. All you, G. Last one. Come on. Yup. Yup. Fight. Let's go, G. Well done. Stand by yourself, you know. You didn't help me in that tempo? I was gonna, but you kind of... I don't start applying pressure until I'm, I'm, I'm like there towards the halfway. And I think it's those first three that you were like, just go. Every rep I kept finding like my, my placement, you know? Oh, okay. I, I was just like... Okay. So until that third one is like where I got it, and then that's when I... Fuck. So after about two to three warm-ups, now we're going into our two hard working all out sets. Vinny thinks he's gonna make me see hell, but not today, baby. Not today. All right, guys. Brings us to our last working set. These are probably not just the least important, they are the most important because you wanna go as hard as you can as possible in these sets. Even, it's like I said, excruciating, like it comes to having a workout partner, it is excruciating to have one that you can rely on to push you past your limits, because those reps past your limits are going to be absolutely crucial for your muscle growth, as well as when you're trying to build muscle. So, let's get it guys. We got three plates on the rack. We're gonna try to do as much as we can. Last set was like 15, with help of G, with about three or so. So, let's see what we can do. Let's get it. Let's go big guy. Yep, all you, Vinny. Let's go. Strong. Yeah. Big. Yeah. 
Yep. Give me one more. Give me one more. Give me one more. Two. All right. Two. Two it is. Let's go. Up. Yep. Big. Come on. Let's go. Up. Let this be known, this is the most weight I've ever done in this pendulum squat. As I told you guys when G went to the bathroom, this is the most weight he's ever done. You were talking shit while I was gone. I was talking mad shit while you were gone. Oh, fucking guy. <clears throat> Three. Three. <sighs> Explode. <clears throat> Up. <clears throat> Come on. No, it's heavy, G. Huh? Let's go. Get your feet right and go. Come on. Six. Come on. Seven. Come on, I want three more. Come on. Big feet. Nice. Come on, two more, buddy. You got this. Yup. Yup. Six. Come on, last one. I'm with you. I'm with you. Let's go. Come on. Push. Up. Last one, oh, last one, come on, let's go, I know it hurts, keep going, yup, 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 you don't think that was a tragic moment? Yeah, okay. I'm gonna get you a shirt that says one more. Because you're a fucking liar. Alright, guys, so that finishes up with the pendulum. As you can see, we got our legs firing, everything's working, and blood's flowing. And now we're going to move on to leg extensions. I currently cannot do leg extensions just to keep it short and brief. I had in my teardrop in my left leg, I had a little bit of an injury. Um, it was a little bit of muscle cramps, and for some reason, hitting single leg leg extensions or leg extensions, period. Um, with doing that with my knee, it just really, really hurts. So we're just gonna alternate that with lunges. G's gonna do leg extensions. We're gonna do this for about two touch sets, which are just warm-ups, and then two working sets. We're gonna go hard as shit on these, and then we're gonna move on to our next compound. So let's get it. Last one. Come on, breathe. Yup. <laughs> now pulse. Let's go. Yup. I know we just started and I'm not exaggerating, but I think I need to throw up. You know, I thought this leg day would be a lot better for me being that we're training in the evening and I got a lot more meals in me compared to when I'm training at 12 or 1. I only have two meals, but... Yeah, I feel just as bad. And I thought I just got over that hump of not needing the Gatorade to bring me back to life, but no, here we are. And I just noticed that this is zero Gatorade, meaning zero sugar. This is useless. Fuck. Alright guys, so this machine is very good if you know, because foot placement is very, very important. Half foot on, half of the foot off. You, like I said, you want to make sure that your heels, you're fighting your heels coming off of the pad. Push your feet backwards a little bit. You want to, as you can see, G is pushing his body into the pad, keeping his core tight, as well as keeping all the pressure in his big toe. 
and which is really emphasizing the tr contraction and squeeze here, it's going to keep a lot of tension in that quad. It's going to hurt, but it's supposed to. So if you keep that squeeze and then explode up, you're going to feel a lot of blood flow pushing through here. You don't need a lot of weight, like I said. If you're going to do this, lower the weight, focus on using the movement and the muscle, and then explode. Yeah, I need your help. Whatever, when you fucking fixed it, we still had like another 30 reps. Huh? Oh my god. It's heavy at the start. Buddy, you still got another 45 on there. Yeah, you said take one off. On each side. Explode. Push yourself on the top. Ooh. Yeah, there it is. Slow, slow. Then explode. Nice. Yep. Very good. Fight it. There it is. One more. One more? Yeah. Come on. Last one. Make it count. Yep. There it is. Slow in the negative. Yep. Breathe. The worst part is you can't get the fuck out. Getting my legs out. Oh, so That has to be like one of the worst supersets I've ever done. Yeah. Just about. Well, your quad just got nothing left. Well, that's why it's a finisher. Oh my god. I think I need another Gatorade. Damn, man. I just want to go home. Are we done? Yeah. It's a wrap, dude. It's already like 9.30 at night. I yep. gotta go home and eat, and you guys know how I love to eat. Got like two more meals. You know, you know what helps me a little? Record again. Love you guys. Just, bro, just get me out of here already. I wanna go home, I'm tired. All right guys, this brings this leg day to an end. As I said, we came, we saw, we conquered, and G definitely got his death sets in. <laughs> yeah, I did. He's definitely gonna feel it tonight, tomorrow, and the next day after, even worse. I will. So, <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna leave it to G, guys. We're pretty cooked. We're done here. We've been here for a couple hours, just blasting our legs to oblivion. So and, I'm gonna leave it to G. And you still have cardio, so. And I still have cardio. Thanks for a reminder. No problem, but you're doing very good. Update on min, on Vinny's mini cut. What do we got, 10, 10 pounds down? We are 10. We are 10 pounds down. Exactly, I, I, I 10.4. Think, I think last video was nine, so now we're on 10. So we're making progress. We got two more weeks for Vinny to cut down a little bit before he continues his and restarts his lean bulk, but that's pretty much it. I know I haven't said it here, but as much as I want to punch Vinny sometimes in the face, it's all love, and I do really appreciate, and I'm really excited, honestly, for these next few months and next year, because I think we got a great thing going on here, and I think he is really that, let me see, the missing piece to the puzzle that can really help me push me 
to the next level because there's only so much you can do by yourself. And I think I'm a pretty well-driven individual, but when you got someone like Vinny that can kind of, again, turn you up a little bit and shift your mind to just be here, forget about everything else, and just you know be in the present and just freaking push, I think it's extremely important. So I'm really excited for what's to come, and I think he's going to get me that much closer to my goal. So that's pretty much it for today, guys. Um, it is pretty late, so as always, like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you're new. I appreciate you guys for watching. Stay tuned for tomorrow's video. We're almost there. Peace, baby. Peace. Oh my God, I can't even get up. Oh, oh, hey. Oh yeah, oh. we're doing one of those? Oh, we're doing hey. One of those? Ah, Sam. Damn, son. You know I got bigger legs than Sam? <laughs> <laughs> I actually do. <laughs> uh.